525, May 31st, just west of El Reno or on the west side of El Reno. Storm severe warrant just now crossing I-40. downtown El Reno. It is coming directly into El Reno and it doesn't appear like it's going to be lifting anytime soon. It is on the ground now right here. You see the hook. Now here's El Reno right here. You see the hook there coming around and the velocities are continuing to climb and come up. Uh, there's one tornado warning in our viewing area. It is for Canadian County. It is for this storm. Awesome Let's go back to Reed Timmer in your live stream. Looking at it, Reed, uh, just northwest of the El Reno airport right now. Yes, Mike. It's, it's, it's sort of broad and trying to crank down, Mike. It's not a, a what, what I would call a textbook funnel or like going to a ledge. But the entire, uh, the entire uh, rotation is almost all the way down to the ground with a speeder band coming into it. it it's almost like the wall cloud has dropped almost to the ground. There it is. See it? which is getting there right now, 3.75, begins at El Reno and is along I-40. You do not want to be traveling in the westbound on I-40, anywhere near this. Uh, this is a multi-vortex, there it is, multi-vortex tornado on the ground. Go Mark Dillon. That is going to be a fucking beast, Matt. <laughs> Thank you. 
Reed Timmer's in the Dominator, and folks, uh, this is serious for Canadian County. Uh, let's go to the Storm Tracker. We're going to break away. We're going to go to the Storm Tracker. We're going to go to the Storm Tracker. We're going to go to the Where is this headed? It's a large multi-vortex tornado, 3.75 inch diameter hail. You uh, can Here's Richland, here's Yukon, here's Mustang. Bethany's right here. It is heading directly down Interstate 40. Back to Reed Timmer here in Dominator 4. Large multi-vortex tornado on the ground. Go, Reed. We gotta get back and go south. Uh, an eye. The eye is a quarter mile wide. It is, right 608. There. This is baseball. Large tornado, tornado on the ground. Reno resumed all just the way south in. of Reno. Turning, it is just turning around. Go all these vortices, it's glowing in size. And this is very concerning. Folks in the past, Prepare for a violent tornado. If this is indeed like moving to the south and east, we are going to head closer towards it. We are due north of this tornado right now. And it has a very violent motion associated with it. Special Canadian County in Central Oklahoma, middle 7 p.m. Central National Weather Service in Norman has issued a tornado warning for northeastern Grady County in central Oklahoma. Hey, will you do me a favor? Will you hold this camera so I can take a piss real quick? Until 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Will you hold this so I can take a piss real quick? Yeah, you bet. Looks like it's kind of getting rained on. Meteorologists and storm spotters were tracking a large and extremely dangerous tornado six miles southwest of El Reno. Doppler radar showed this tornado moving southeast at 20 miles an hour.
You okay? Oh, dude, that that, that was fucking terrifying. Yeah. There you go. Let's see what the storm's doing. Oh yeah. fuck. Man, we are so lucky to be alive. I right know now. it. You did a good job driving that. That was pure luck. That's it. It's right there. We gotta get east. It's on the ground still. We'll go another mile south. I'm not getting close to that thing. from last night's tornado. See all these white specks all along the car on this right side. I got sand blasted. It's basically little pieces of rock and debris. After the window or as the windows got busted out, pelting the side of the car. Everything's just coated with this dusty mud on the inside. It broke the front windshield in a few places. Broke out that window. Just sandblasted this whole side of the car. Broke out those two windows, that back window, and then that this rear one. See all the mud and stuff just caked on this side of the